everyone, I'm finally updating! Yay! <laughs> the reason I haven't updated for such a long time is because I was in the hospital for a very long time. The reason I was in the hospital is because I had bad um, reaction to the radiation from one of the side effects, which was mouth sores. And I want to tell everyone that is going through radiation, do your mouth care. No matter how much it tastes bad and you want to throw up, do your mouth care is important. I had sores covering my mouth. They were white, they were big, they were yes, they were covered my mouth, my tongue, my throat, all around the uvula. I could not talk, I could not eat. I was communicating with flashcards and writing down stuff. I could not I couldn't do anything. I had to be admitted into the hospital and they had to give me pain medicine because it hurt. <laughs> Those sores hurt. <laughs> I had to be hooked up to nutrition because I couldn't eat and I had to do a special numbing mouthwash called magic mouth every two hours and I did that throughout the night <laughs> I had a month of no sleep every two hours throughout the night throughout the day it's numbing mouthwash just so I could talk the littlest bit and I still had to do more radiation while I was in the hospital I was in the hospital for five six weeks and I had, I think, like three, three more treatments, or like a week still of treatment when I was first admitted. And it was horrible. When I finally, I was fu because I was in the hospital, I was finally able to heal. And uh, once I was done with radiation, and I started being, the sores started going down, I started trying to eat again. And then I was still stuck in the hospital, and they wouldn't give me my chemotherapy because I was on nutrition. This nutrition is called TPN and it was destroying my liver. So I had to learn how to eat again and get myself to gain weight in order to get my chemotherapy and get off of this TPN. I was in the hospital for such a long time. <laughs> I started going crazy, I think, after a while. Um, oh my god, you do not want to stay in the hospital for a long time. Finally, I'm better though. I'm finally home, as you can tell, in my house. And, um, finally eating again, getting 3,000 calories in, uh, every day. That is my goal every day. I track them on the iPod. <laughs> and, um, I'm feeling pretty good, but I'm going to have another week of chemo coming up, and it's two chemos I have never had before. <laughs> so, we'll see how I do with that. <laughs> and that's basically it. I'm finally home. And uh, mouth, sore, mouth sores definitely stink. And uh, to everyone else who has to go through this horrible, horrible, um, can't you know any horrible cancer, and has to do radiation, do your mouth care. <laughs> I do it three times a day, like I'm told, and it tastes bad, but it's worth it. <laughs> mouth sores are not fun. <laughs> also, you like my little fuzz? Yeah, fuzz. <laughs> Fuzzy hair, because I wasn't having chemotherapy for such a long time, I grew back some hair. <laughs> and eyebrows. And eyelashes. I didn't have those for a long time. <laughs> anyway, bye! <laughs>